Well, a sad update tonight. Back in January, we told you about Roxy, the longest resident at Grand Strand Humane Society, who was adopted by a Florida couple. Now her family says she's battling a terminal illness and has only months to live. New at 11, News 13's Adriana Lawrence spent the afternoon with Roxy and her family while they were in town for her Humane Society friends to say goodbye. She's, she's made my life awesome, and I'm, I'm very distraught to know that she's not going to be there. Seven-year-old Roxy spent five years at Grand Strand Humane Society. Many remember her when she came in around two years old, scared and not sure who to trust. We've taken a lot of trips to Wendy's, sat in the playground, gone swimming, car rides. Um, she is definitely my heart of the shelter. It's, I mean, she's everything to me. Finally, Roxy found her forever home in Florida with Melanie and Jeff Struble. All three came to visit in June, and volunteers were looking to make their own trip to see her in Florida. But no one knew two months later, Roxy would be diagnosed with cancer and have limited time left. We're not ready, and she deserves so much more. We wanted to give her no less than as long as she had in the shelter. But, uh, you know, sadly, that's not my, my choice. Volunteers like Michelle Miller not ready to say goodbye either. When I leave today and she goes home, I may never see her again. And that's probably going to be one of the hardest things that in my heart, she'll always be in my heart. The Struvels wanted to bring Roxy up while she was still feeling okay and share these last moments with her former family. A similar thought wandering through many. It's very unfortunate. I felt like, why did she spend so much time in the shelter only to find an amazing home and get sick. But Struble says even with all that time, she's had the most amazing life outside of it, even if it was just for a few months. You know, maybe it was meant to be that we would give her this little bit of time before this terrible thing got her. A sad ending, but Roxy will continue to live on in all of the hearts she touched. Love you. Al Struble says they're planning more road trips and any way to keep her comfortable. She encourages anyone interested in adopting to not forget about senior or sick dogs because all animals deserve life outside of a shelter, even if it's just for a few months. Live in the newsroom, Adrian Lawrence, News 13.